Hey, that's Mike and Holly, Alex, Eddie, and Chelsea. Holly, yes. I hate those. I just found this bug in the house. I captured it to release it. <laughs> yeah, I know you want it. No, you can't. Ooh, creepy crawly. Oh, he was moving really fast. Now he's not. Come outside. I'm dying cold. No. Dying snow. I saved him. I was just giving him a little nudge so we could see him running. <laughs> okay, I'll go set him free now. All right, everybody, top of the morning to ya. Happy St. Patrick's Day. Look at this girl, I'm gonna show you top to bottom. She's got her St. Patrick's Day hair bow. I should put my hair chalk. I have green hair chalk. Okay, let me show this okay, first. She's got a green beaded necklace. Look at, she did chalk art on her face. <laughs> Here for the shenanigan shirt. Some cool tattoos. She did all this by herself, by the way. Tattoo. Um, your shamrock bracelet, right? And then these are lucky brand jeans. Lucky brand jeans, that's right. I almost forgot about that. Okay, so she's gonna do hair chalk in a little bit. Okay, all not right. not started yet. Not started yet, but Chelsea is wanting to make green eggs for lunch. Yes. Kind of like green eggs and ham, but we don't have ham. <laughs> and green yes, that's, that's true. Also, I am old enough to be making my own food. I, I'm 10. I'm short. No. <laughs> Chelsea. Okay. Oh, you already got the... Okay, careful with that because that could get on stuff and just do one drip for now and then mix it up and see how green it turns. So just a, a drop of food coloring. Uh, I don't think that's enough. Well, mix it up real good and then see. I'm not gonna start it. You just don't have it all mixed up yet, so you still have some spots are darker than the others. That looks really cool. It does look really cool. Green eggs. So that's what it's looking like. It's cooking now. Can I have the stove on? Just turned on the stove. Okay, and then we will show what it looks like. I gotta keep misking. I'm misking. Misking. Gotta keep mixing it. All right, so here's what they look like. Done. They're very green. Very, very green, aren't they? Very green. <laughs> they took a little longer to cook. So I think because of the moisture of the food. I feel like I need to get as many as much egg as I did yesterday. Oh. So I made eggs yesterday. Yeah. All right, there you have it. Green eggs. Quite healthy. All, Except all for the green. Cheetos. Yeah. <laughs> and those aren't green either. This, that's green my eggs, side dish. Lettuce and pickles. Wait. How? You did the wrong bowl. Oh my gosh. I have a green bowl. She's got her green bowl. Okay, so eggs. Gonna give them a taste. Actually, wait. No, I just ran over and flirt. Oh my gosh. All right. hard to eat. <laughs> it might be a little hard to eat. That's okay. No, no, no. Not for you, picks. They just taste like eggs. I mean, like the slightest bit of change. Oh. <laughs> hey guys. Well, I hate to, uh, you're so cute. Oh my gosh. I hate to make this kind of vlog again, but it's happened again. I was walking Pixel and we went a different way than where, no, this wasn't really a different way that it happened before. Anyway, I was walking Pixel and a dog charged us again. I'm trying really hard not to cry. I'm really upset. Um, this dog is three times the size of Pixel. It's a huge, huge dog. I'm not gonna say the breed because um, I know this is a good breed of dog and I don't think it has anything to do with the breed of the dog. Um, this dog has um, approached us before and has always acted like it's kind of wanted to play with Pixel and it's just such a big dog. There is no way like if something were to happen that I could have any control over the situation. It's played with her before, like they've kind of romped around and played, but I've kept it really short and just like kept walking because the dog, I think the owner's 
expect it to stay in the yard. And typically, like I've seen it stay in its yard and I've seen it walk right next to its owner on a walk and like not on a leash. Um, so I think it's probably pretty well trained, but uh, one time it tried to follow us. It just wanted to play with Pixel and I get that. Um, and I had to take it back home <laughs> and it's like, um, your dog is like, I didn't want it to continue to follow us and then get lost or I don't know. This time was different. It approached us and we were like three, four houses down from its house. So it made its way to us, um, saw us and made its way to us. We weren't in its yard or anything like that. Um, Pixel had just gotten finished going potty and then it, it kind of like snuck up behind her, which is not a big deal. She's a big chicken and she's just a love. She wants to love every dog, every person, um, which is part of the problem. She won't fight back. But anyway, um, it kind of snuck up on her and I was like, oh, hey. And I said the dog's name because I know the dog's name. Um, and I kind of, I don't know, like because I've, ex I've seen it be friendly before and play and romp around with her before and no problems. This time it was growling at her like several times and then it was smelling the area that she had just pottied in and then it continued to growl and so I was just like come on pixel and like um you know like had her I had the leash tight the whole time and like had her right next to me because you just never know I've talked about this before you never know even dogs that seem friendly can get an attitude sometimes this dog's head <laughs> like I can't even because my hands are holding the camera um you know, like I said, if it would have done anything, I, I would have been helpless. Um, my point being to, that I want to get across is, oh my gosh, it, it's the law. You're supposed to keep your dog contained to your yard, under your control, on a leash. So anyway, if you're a dog owner, please, for the love, keep it on a leash or like when it's outside, when it's outside, keep it on a leash, keep it in your yard. I'm just being extra super cautious with Pixel because she is such a big baby and she will not defend herself and it would come down to me having to step in and protect her and then I would probably get hurt. So just please be responsible. She is in my lap. I came in here to vlog because Chelsea's downstairs playing with her friends and they're being quite loud. And she was just like, oh, hey mom, what you doing? And now um, I'm kind of stuck here because <laughs> she's... She's so sweet and so snuggly and guys, I love her so much. This is why I get so shook up about these things is I love her so much and I just, I do not want to go through a bad experience with her getting hurt or me getting hurt. Count. Are you supposed to guess first though? Mm. I'm not gonna shake it too hard because it's breakable. Uh, one dollar and 47 cents is my guess. What's your guess? 77 cents. Oh. 50 cents. Uh, now, uh, a dollar. Can you open it or do you know? Whoever's closest gets the money. What? I say whoever's closest gets the money. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> gotta go through Chelsea. I was the one that found most of the coins. Oh, that don't. Oh, there's still a lot more. I think somebody cheated. What? No, I didn't. How much did you say? 147. Oh. And you said dollar and I said 77. Well, I'm not right. There's four quarters right there. Chelsea's not right because there's some there. And then we got pennies, so it was a dollar 76. So I was the closest. I get to keep it. I could go to the dollar 25 tree. Whoa! Whoa! <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> All right, tell everybody what we're doing. Dragon fruit. We're doing dragon fruit? Yeah. <laughs> what are we doing with it? <laughs> are we going to throw it? Eat it. <laughs> All right, Chelsea's been asking so for dragon fruit. the longest fruit. time, and I haven't been able to find them. She says she's never she's had them before, but I thought I remember Well, then how would you know? I thought you had it before and you wanted it. Ooh. Okay, so you cut Ooh, it in half. that's weird. I've never had it before. Now you can do what Chelsea's doing and you can scoop it out the middle or you can continue to cut it. Go ahead. Try it. Go ahead. 
Now some of them are sweeter, especially if you let it like maybe sit and ripen a little bit. The texture is way different than How do you know if it's ripe? <laughs> what does ripe look like? It's oh, ripe. I don't know. I gave it a, it's kind of a little soft when you squeeze it, but not overly yeah. soft. It's good. It might taste better cold, like cold, like refrigerated. Mm -hmm. Can I try? I like it. That's yeah, it so wasn't weird. refrigerated at the store. It so was weird. just out like with tomatoes and stuff like that. I would eat it every day if I could. Can you buy me more? <laughs> You've taken like two bites of this one so far. It Three. doesn't really taste like anything. It has the littlest hint of sweet, but there's not I like a lot of Maybe it's not right then. Yeah, it's just Michael went in for it and I said, don't eat the skin. I've heard that the skin can make you feel yucky. Like give you a tummy ache real bad and make you throw up. It's, it's like a very flavorless pear. It has no, it doesn't have any flavor. Yeah, we put it in the fridge. The yeah, there's the, no, there's just very bland. small sweet, but there's a bitterness, like aftertaste to it. And so I had looked this up online and the guy was saying that there are some um, from Asia that aren't as ripe, I guess. And then there's some from like Mexico that are Mexico. Not as ripe. sweet, not as sweet. Um, there's, there's other types, I guess, that are sweeter. So that would probably be more so up my alley. Weird. It is, like, isn't it? Is, okay, well, the pink isn't even hard. It's like rubber. He was saying that Look some, that. the other ones are um, pink in the middle. But yeah, he was saying like the skin is really no good for anything. He's I don't like, know why you'd want he's like it's like leather. You could make a shoe out of it. Can you eat it near <laughs> the skin? Can you eat it near the skin? Just not. Probably. Just don't get any of the like the pink You're from probably, the skin. You probably won't be able to get the skin from the skin.